And once again, Momo runs across the screen. Oh yes, this is the boss battle against the governor of the Fire Nation. And that is King Boomy. Why do they have him inside of a metal coffin? Well, I'll tell you in a minute. This is Aang, the mighty Avatar. Governor, is that you? Where did you come from? Quiet, you. Let him go. He's the king of this city. How dare you lock him up? I rule this city now. The king is dead. Long live the king. I'm not dead. <laughs> Quiet, you. That's it. I'm tired of talking. Guard. Destroy them both. Okay, why do they have him, the King Boomy, uh, locked up into a metal crate? Basically, earthbenders cannot earthbend in, um, in metal. So that's basically why they have him locked up inside of a metal crate, so that he cannot earthbend and escape from there. Because if he can earthbend, he's probably one of the more, uh, most powerful earthbenders, and in fact, he is the most powerful earthbender in the city of Omashu. So obviously, he would be able to fight them. And I just fell off the ledge. I don't know why I thought you would have to attack him. Anyway, now that I've kind of given you a background, let's take on the governor of the Fire Nation, or, you know, the guy that was in charge of taking over Amashu. And we actually get to see some firebending moves that are not in a cutscene. Holy crap. Get over that. Okay, you're going down. He did not knock me off the ledge. Oh, crap. And can I use my special attack? I will take that hit as a no. Nope, can't use it yet. I honestly don't know what the qualifications of using a special attack are. To be honest, I can't remember. Yeah, I'm gonna fall off the. Oh, holy crap! I didn't fall off the ledge. Get over here. Oh, he's in the red already, so. <laughs> How do you like being combo now? Alright, I'm gonna switch. Whoops, Aang's dead. So I'll switch over to Katara. Actually, Katara's gonna do him so hard. Is there a way I can... Okay, hit the up button on the, um... On the, um... I don't really know what those are called. I guess the D-pad of the PlayStation controller. You know, the PlayStation 2 controller. And use an item. Because as you can see, now we had four, and I only have five left, so... Da, 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 da. You're not gonna hit me. Okay. It's all now. Come on, crazy. Well, I guess we'll never know. Oh, this might have to go into a half part. Wow, I never thought I'd actually have to make an LP, like side LP half part. Go figure. Stop hitting me. Holy crap, I need another item. All right, I think he just spams this attack, basically. He spams that fire wave attack, and he spams that um, big fire ring attack. And okay, here we go. Earth bending time, or avatar state time. Notice they always threaten Katara when, you know, he has to go into the avatar state. Bye-bye, buddy. You put up a good fight, but it's over. You're safe now, Boomy. We're gonna get you out of here, Boomy. <gasps> oh, poor he's gonna tell me there's another phase to this fight. Cause I honestly don't remember this. I don't okay, I guess not. Why didn't you free yourself? Why did you surrender when Omashi was invaded? What's the matter with you, Boomy? And why don't you wait and listen? I'm waiting. Excellent. Now you've got it. You've always been a quick learner. What are you talking about, Boomy? The key to earth bending is listening and waiting for the right moment to strike. That's why you surrender, isn't it? Yes. And it's why I can't leave now. I guess I need someone else to teach me your fending. Your teacher will be someone who waits and listens before striking. Okay, Boomy. I'll trust you. Take care, old friend. Yep, yep. 
I have no idea how you just controlled that metal box to go up the mail cart, but anyway. So chapter two is complete. We defeated the governor. I'm gonna say that does it for this episode. So if you like this part, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I will have more Avatar The Burning Earth coming at you soon. Bye-bye.